There's only one learning objective for TR-15. Identify the values of sine and cosine for the common angles. By now, for any of the 17 common angle points on a unit circle, you should be able to identify its measure in degrees and radians, and its cosine and sine, which are the point's coordinates on the unit circle. This really shouldn't involve memorization, and with practice it shouldn't be much of a challenge. There are 17 points to know, with A and Q at the same point, representing the zero angle and the full rotation angle, respectively. You should be able to fill out this chart. It might take a few minutes, but with practice, you shouldn't have trouble doing this. If you need a refresher, we covered angle measurements in degrees in video TR-04. Angle measurements in radians was TR-06. If you've been following along, Please, please create this grid and fill it out. This should be your goal at this point. You don't have to be fast, but you shouldn't get stuck. I'll show the answers and that will be the end of this video.